see. Where am I in the game, by the way? Hang on. Let's pull up the map. I'm, I'm so thrown off. I'm used to playing over here. Okay. Let's check. Map mode. Where we gotta go? No, that's a custom marker. Zoom out. Okay. Oh! Oh, we gotta go back to tower. Oh, y'all. City ruin center. Okay. That's where we're going. Okay, y'all. It's about to happen. All right. Okay. Let's do this thing. Got to get my got to get my chair set. Also, the monitor is so close to me compared to what I had. Woo, I feel like I'm in the game. I feel like I'm in the game right now. Okay. Thank you for that posture check. Ah. What? Not yet? Oh, I gotta do these ones. Oh. Okay, there's one. Hack that. Cruising right through this. Dolphin, how you doing? Ba -da -da -da. Oh, what? It's true. We're only four months into March. <laughs> only four months into March, everybody. <laughs> Thank you so much for that sub at tier one. Can I get hearts and hype in chat, please? Oh, we're going in the tower, y'all. I'm ready for that special prize. Oh my God, really? Oh my God. Okay, we got a lot of we got a lot of stuff going on now. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, my heavens. Oh, jeez. We're only six months. Oh, negative six months into 2021. I like that. Yeah, I feel at this point I'm, I'm, I'm kind of moved on to 2021. Damn it. They won't stop coming. And, and here's the thing. When we get to, like... New Year's? Like, am I going to... Am I going to be celebrating 2021? Wait, you? I'm not certain at this point. Nine -S. Wait, what? We've been expecting you. Wait, what? <clears throat> what? Oh. Oh, they're helping me. Never mind. We're good. We'll take things from here. <laughs> you need to open the door to the tower. All right, let's do it. Door to the tower, going. Devola? Obola? What are you doing here? Remember your promise? What are you talking about? Come on, Nines. Hack in while you can. I'm None hacking. This makes any sense. We'll Just hack. Once we're inside. Hack it. There they go. Oh, I love watching them on the map just completely wrecking things. Dude. Dude, they're so boss. I love this. Keep hacking. We've got this, 9S. 
You just focus on hacking. Yeah, don't you worry, ladies. We're going in. Got this. Whoa, heavens. Okay, that was close. Go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Where are they at? No. What's this barrier? Analysis. It is part of a closed defensive system. Okay. Well, how do I break it down? Hypothesis. Unit 9S could permit his self-consciousness data to lose control. The resulting energy surge has an acceptable probability of temporarily paralyzing the barrier. Uh -oh. That's almost as bad as not going in at all! So I'm giving over my consciousness? Oh, come on, Nines! Come on! Oh, she did it. She did it. Go! Devola! I hope you don't regret this. What? They just sacrificed themselves. Are you kidding me? Are you... What? Huh? Oh, come on! Oh, I've had the AC on constantly, Dolphin. Oh, come on, Shelly! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Do you wish to open this data now? Open it! Put me in! No use in waiting. There we go. A dusty wind kisses my cheeks. Buried in sand, we press forward one step at a time. We have nowhere else to go, after all. Because our models... Oh, wait, hang on, it's the ladies. Hang on. Hold, please. I need a different... Oh, crap, I don't have a... No, no, it's, it's fine. Forget it. <laughs> the Vola and Bobola models are defective. I didn't have a proper voice ready for them. Record. Transitions in the project's initial phase. That's fine, I'm just gonna use their voice. When first we woke, there were still people. They had flesh, egos, emotions, souls, and they issued us a single order. Function as observers of Project Crystal. This is the sole mission of the twin Devil and Bobola models. It is the only reason we exist at all. We were the latest model, though. Many companions shared our appearance. There was a sparkle in all of our eyes. A sense of pride at having been entrusted with humanity's future. And yes, there was anxiety as well. But we existed as a pair. We shared destiny's burden as a pair. And because of that, all hesitation was swept away. Each pair was given their own cities as observation areas. We were ordered to guide the replicants with our own hands, all for the sake of the promised time that one day would one day... Take that back to one. And action. All for the sake of the promised time that would one day arrive. We were the only ones who could handle such a duty. We were observers, after all. Get the way I read that. Watch out! Devla staggers and falls in the soft yet unforgiving sand. I hurry to her side and sigh with relief when I find she's not seriously hurt. Who wrote this? Like, who wrote this, y'all? This is like 
fan fiction level. Yeah, come on, come on, like, all right, y'all. What is going on with this? Oh, oh, I have a choice. You did a thing or more accurately, you finally, wait, what'd you watch? Hang on. What did you watch? Finally watched a thing. What's the thing you watched? Also, which should I choose? Number one or number two? Number one, check the circuitry to see if it can be repaired. Number two, replace the bandage and hope for the best. What path should I take here? You saw Hamilton! Bop, 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 bop. How does a bastard, orphan, son of a whore, and a Scotsman? Uh, repair, repair. Alright, we're repairing. As expected, wiring in the nerve circuitry had been damaged. Replacing it will require new connectors, as well as some tools. None of which is easy to find in a desert. None of which are easy to... N none of which... None are easy. None of which is easy. I'm, I'm confused by the English there. It's fine. Now you understand the references. Yes! Work! I love that line that he does. Talking about Thomas Jefferson. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. And then... They say how they want women written in the sequel. Work. All for it. All for it. There was one part you really, really didn't like. Was it... Why don't I say no to this? That song. I feel really uncomfortable when he's singing that, but I love the track. I love that track. No to this. Just that whole scene. That whole scene, I'm just like, come on, buddy. Was it that, that part? Yeah. Yeah. You're like, you're fighting for him, you're fighting for him, you're fighting for him, and you're just like, ah, come on, dude. Come on, dude. There's a, there's a, there's a particular line with that, though. There's a particular line with that that is damn good writing. Hang on. Yeah, Lord, show me how to say no to this. I don't know how I to say no to this, but there's a, a, a particular line. This right here. I wish I could say it was the last time I said that last time it became a pastime. That line, boom! I'm just like, dude, you're a cheater. <laughs> you're a serial cheater. I love that. I wish I could say that was the last time I said that last time it became a pastime. I'm just like, oh, gut punch, dude. For two years! It's been 84 years. Two years. King George's songs? You say... The price of my love. What a pi price you are willing to pay. It's such a fun role. Yeah, don't modulate the key and not debate with me. Oh yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. That's... When the king's messenger is standing on the uh, the box, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> oh yeah, when when the the king spits it. Oh yeah, yeah, dude. Such a such a great great performance. I I got to see it when it was during its tour. Such a good show. Oh yeah, there's that's the thing. That's what that's why I really appreciate that. Hang on. Okay. Before we continue this, let's talk. Hang on. This is this is a Hamilton moment. Yeah, I appreciate that there were jokes on the actual music of the songs uh, as well. Um, but just like the wordplay alone is what I'm I'm all for. Like, yeah, I want to say like the good hits for me are that. I wish I could say it was the last time I said that last time. It became a pastime. I'm just like, dude, come on. And then there's another one. Which track is it in? Hang on. Let's pull this here. I'm just pulling up all the songs. Dear Theodosia is my favorite track. <laughs> I'm so blue. Stomps it. Uh, you muted yourself? Nah, I didn't. If I did, then something's broken. Um, yeah, I see output on my side. Yeah. Uh, let me see here. Dear Theodosia, what to say to you? You have my eyes. You have your mother's name. When you came into the world, you cried. You broke my heart. Oh, it's so good. So good. Um, Where is it? Where is... There's another key line. That's just like... Oh! Oh, y'all. There's the moment in... Is this it here? Where, oh where? Hang on, I'm finding it. I'm finding it. Hold please, hold please, hold please. Yeah, no one was, was distinctly the villain. You'd think that Burr is, but it's like, mm, no. He's just painted to be the villain, and that breaks my heart at the end. Where is it? Where oh where is it? Oh, here we go. There's a moment during Satisfied that I find to be brilliant. I'm trying to find the moment. Oh, this is it. The conversation lasted two minutes, maybe three minutes. Everything we said in total agreement. It's a dream, and it's a bit of a dance, a bit of a posture. It's a bit of a stance. It's a bit of a flirt, but I give it a chance. I asked his family, did you see his answer? His hands started fidgeting. He looked at the scan. He's penniless. He's flying by the seat of his pants. Handsome, yeah, and then it goes, handsome boy, does he know it? Peach fuzz, and he can't even grow it. Like, just these little observations, I'm just like, dude. Like, noticing quotidian gestures in music is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Like, I love those moments where it's just like, oh, you're actually making small observations on an individual, but you're calling it out in song, but you're doing so in such a pattern that makes it even more uncomfortable. Like, that's the stuff. I'm like, yes. Brilliant. Brilliant. Anyhow. Anyhow. Okay. I know we're going off on too, too much about it. If Hamilton was at the pace of most other Broadway plays, it'd be six hours long. Uh, well, I mean, well, well if you mean... Oh, you mean with how much they cram in per track? Like in terms of the amount of like like story and at least the pacing of the music? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I mean, that's that's what makes it brilliant. There was the who was it? Oh my god, it was somebody in one of Chris's like old theater company crews said they they didn't they they didn't want to watch Hamilton uh, Hamilton because they don't like rap. They're just like, yeah, I don't think I like it. I just don't like rap. I'm like, are you kidding me? That's the that's it. <laughs> That's the reason you're not going to watch it? You don't like rap? There's so many genres of music just crammed into a single thing. It's poetry. It's basically like the... It's, uh, bad comparison, but modern day Shakespeare in terms of poetry. Like, that's the way I, I view this. It's like, y'all. Y'all. Oh, Earthbound. Yeah. Yeah, I got Earthbound tattooed on me. I don't like the game at all. I really, really don't like the game at all. One of the worst, one of the worst games ever made. Absolutely hate it. I definitely don't have mint condition copies of the game and toys in a curio cabinet. Overrated. <laughs> Yeah, it's about the story. It's about the story, and also just the execution of it. Like, look at what they do. Also, look at what they do in the staging of that. There's so many... So did you just watch it once, Velvet, thus far? Next time you go back and watch it, watch what all the swings are doing in the background in each scene. Like, that aspect of direction is what makes me miss what I, do, what I used to do for a living, which was direct musicals. Like, I look at that, and I'm just like, holy crap, that is brilliant use of a space. Like, brilliant use of an open theater space. When they're talking about hurricanes, how they're, they're, how they're transforming, using just small objects, how the bodies become the wind, how they constantly reprise the fact of his dead mother, they lift the one dancer in the air for the dead mother. Like, there's so many little things, I'm just like, brilliant, like you there, brilliant there, I'm just like, hmm. Yeah, I'm obsessed with it. And also, they, they for the revolution of time, they were using the revolving stage, similar to what they used for Les Mis, which is also about revolution. Revolving stages for revolution, baby. Boom! Easy concept, but it works every single time. <laughs> Blaring Outcast to Earthbound. Hey, both are great. Go from uh, uh, Atlians uh, to Earthbound. I'm all for it. Or AT Aliens. I always said Atlians for that album. Well, that's what the same, uh, same actually with the girl who plays um, Peggy. Peggy, who's also who plays the uh, mistress in No to This. She's not, well, she's not, she's trained because of her parents with influence of jazz, but she's not like a musical theater actor, to my understanding. I think she got like pulled into it as well but yeah like you can't beat it brilliant cast brilliant all around if you haven't watched hamilton go on disney plus watch it it is a necessity uh for uh modern pop culture to to observe what all went into that show uh, and that was supposed to be a theatrical release so for the fact of like what 10 bucks to see a broadway show that cost me 700 dollars to secure a ticket do it just watch it. Well worth it. Well worth it. All right. Back into the game, y'all. Back into the game. Has to be some way to prevent relapses. The little sharp voice echoes through the private quarters. You must be quiet, sister. The replicants will hear. You won't understand even if they did. Yeah, I just started, Xerxes. Just started. Not Well, not too long ago. Well, technically 40 minutes ago, but we're just getting into the swing of it. This is what happens. You bring up musical theater, and I get completely sidetracked. It's like that part of my brain that lays uh, dormant inside. You're just like, boom, fired up. I'm like, oh, okay, you want to talk about staging? Let's talk about staging. Let's talk about, like, references to other musicals that were pulled in. Let's talk about <laughs> all of these things. All 
I'm not really liking this fan fiction portion. Uh, penguins, are you here to give me a TLDR? Here's the problem. I have no attachment to these... To these two. I have no attachment to the two people that are kindly, like, going back and forth right now. Dear Van Hansen Live is incredible. Broadway will be back next year. And and if uh, if if Jordan's continuing in the show, because I know he was supposed to be playing uh, Evan, make sure uh, you go see him uh, in that performance. It's an incredible musical live, and it's very relevant to today. has a lot of um, nods that, for any of us who grew up with... Well, I didn't grow up with social media. I got social media thrown at me uh, as an adult. Um, but if you've ever had to be invested into it, you're going to appreciate it. I really don't care about these two characters that are talking right now. I feel like they're forcing a character investment on me right now. Like, I feel like I'm, I'm being forced into a fan fiction that I just don't care. <laughs> It just keeps going. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm just... I'm over it. I don't care. I don't care. I still don't care. Oh my god. Yes, you're stuck in a desert. You're, you're, you're a robot, but you're not. And you're two robots that barely gave any screen time to. And now I'm supposed to care. <sighs> okay. Here, here, okay, we get to choose something. Do you want to touch a cheek or support a body? <laughs> I'll let you choose the path on this. Alright, we're touching a cheek. Alright, yeah, it's raining. It's raining down her face. <sighs> oh, here's the TLDR. The failure to manage the area resulted in the collapse of the Gestalt system, which led to the uh, decimation of the human race. Due to the discovery of its inability, the twin system was removed from future android production. No one cares. Why do the androids Devla and Popola seem to prefer death over survival alone? Oh, this is an elevator. Alone? There was a very high probability that at least one could have escaped. <laughs> Thank you for changing the topic for the game. Thank God. Ugh. Query. Why does this tower possess an entrance at all? All material transport takes place via aerial vehicles. There we go. It is for an infiltration route to be so easily accessible. Now Access. we're progressing. Entrance is a trap. I don't care. I just have to kill them all. See, I'm with him right now on that same type of perspective. Not caring. Just got to kill them. Here for it. Oh, here we go. That's fine. We can defeat him. All right, moving forward. Hack him. Ah. 
Hey, who loved that? Who loved that middle of nowhere novel that was presented to us? I did. I really loved that novel that in no way helped the progression of what we're doing right now. <laughs> Oh, they just suck. Oh, they just suck. Well, I mean, they don't have pods, too, so there's, like, the fact of, like, they're corrupted. Yeah, no way, no way help progression. I'm gonna kill you. All right, who's in the chapel? All right, let's do this. <laughs> they all look like 2B. 2B models? Uh-oh. He's, he's gonna snap. He's gonna snap. You know what would make this game great in this moment? Let's get another, like, 15 pages of novel to read. I truly am. Oh, shoot. You apart. Oh, the blindfold's off. Every last one of you! He has beautiful blue eyes. Alright, let's go, buddy. Let's do this. The blindfolds are off. Get wrecked. Weapon set one. There we go. To be. To be. Don't worry. I'm going to kill you now. Jesus. Okay, Buddy's snapped. Buddy has snapped. Ah, uh, come on. Oh my God. Oh my God. Come on. Oh, come on. There we go, there we go, there we go. Got it. Level up, 49. Oh boy. There. Come on! Defeat her! Yeah, 2B's back. Yeah, we got a Pangu here. So, Pangu, why was I supposed to care about the novel that was presented to me right before this? Alert. Enemies detected. Still a few stragglers, huh? What was I thinking about for, for... Oh, I need to adjust the spoil emote. I'm going to adjust that one. And then I also... Was thinking about it like a wrecked emote. We said get mecked, but I don't the know if people would actually use that. So. Has opened its gate. Let's check it out. Alright, here she goes. Oh, wait. I can use... Uh, I can use a uh, fast travel. Where am I? Where am I? Wait, no. I'm actually closer here. Why would I go back? I thought I was at the old factory for a second. Ooh, 
Let me in! Oh, shoot! Hey, it's the twins! Uh, A2, right? We went ahead and opened the tower. 9S is already inside. All right. Cool. I see. Thanks for the update. Say, did we? Did we what? Did we manage to help? Mm, debatable. You did. Debatable. I mean, the jury is still out, technically. I'm just gonna walk. On the catwalk. On the catwalk, yeah. Alright, here we go. Glad to see that the items are still maintained. <laughs> this is a Yorha corpse. Hypothesis. The corpse is likely a result of Yorha Unit 9S's advance through the area. Let's go. Oh, oh. Oh, wait, is it still doing a timer for that? <laughs> Thank God. KB is still reminding everybody about the, uh, the non-existent raid. Uh, I mean, non-existent wedding, rather. Yeah, I just, uh, I just told KB not to do that anymore. <laughs> no wedding! What's the purpose of this structure? Unknown. Oh, wait. Gather additional data. Someday I need to teach you how to be wait. helpful. Oh, that's... Oh, wait, he did more damage. Oh, Nines, what'd you do here, buddy? What'd you do here, buddy? What'd you do? Dude! This is giving me major, like, 2001 vibes. Anybody else? The library. What's up with this place? Hypothesis. It is a representation of a library. What's that? A library is a data storage facility constructed by past human civilizations. Hmm. Oh, so the, the twins we were the reason for... The data, yeah? Oh. Hacking interface access rights granted the to reason your for the human death. A2. Peachy. Peachy. Woo, okay. Alright, we are in this to win this. Uh, but how? Uh, oh, I see it. I love mazes. I love them. Oh, wow. Library index. Wasn't them directly, it was just kind of... They didn't help. This tower looks like a data gathering system for the machines. Is it though? Oops, come on. Going a little too fast. Nothing there. Okay, where am I going here? Uh, is it these four standalones I gotta blow up? Check out the doors on the side of the stairs? Okay. There it is. Alright, I'm gonna check out the doors. Get the human server records. 
answer from the human server on the moon. The machines hacked that deep into the system, huh? They did. That was an easy one. Yona. Hmm. Class one patient. That's how you do it. That's how you do it, Jay. Some records on old humans. Damn it, this is useless. I left an item up here. There's too many of them. I got a meteorite. Oh, hello, room. Small recovery obtained. Nothing else. Okay. It's a weird room. Uh. What's with these trophies? Pola's office from the first near? What's all this? That's all the bosses? Oh, those were all the bosses. Whoa, uh, okay. Geeky, hi. Uh, well, we're getting close to the end of this game, and I somehow ended up in the also the ending of 2001 Space Odyssey. It's fine. What's that? What? What's what? Oh, there's one on the other side. Operational summary of model number two in Project Yorha. Oh no, this game is an end. Unlike Final Fantasy XIV Online, which is endless numbers of... <laughs> endless hours of fun. An endless number of hours of fun. Oh, shoot! Okay, we got ourselves a uh, robot boy. <laughs> See a participation trophy? Hey, look. I am all a fan of... The you get ice cream too, even though you lost award. Who's hurting my boy? That's not her. It's not her. It is an evil version of her that wanted to kill you. <laughs> I should just do grunting noises for video games. <laughs> he ripped off her arm. Oh my god, and he took her arm. Cool. And that's how Luke also did it in Star Wars. I can't stop. I have to keep fighting. <laughs> Uh. Alert. Oh man. Virus detected in locomotion region. High probability that infection source is transplanted parts from corrupted units. Oh god. Proposal. Hack into self and eliminate virus. All right. All right. Hack into yourself, bud. All right, let's find that virus, y'all. What if this is how you're supposed to defeat COVID-19, by the way? Business! How you doing, buddy? Alright, we got this. Oh, I haven't yet. I need to do that, Geeky? Don't jump. There's always a door. Oh, shit, ghost girls. No, go away, ghost girls. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Nope. 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 If a, if, a, if a giant waterfall of blood comes out of that door, I'm done. 
Hack the planet, friends. Nope. Can I? Okay. All right. What? Uh, whoa, oh, shoot. What? No. Okay. All right. We got ourselves robots. We got a lot of robots going on right now. Oh, can I get a shout out, please, for business? Ah! One of the OGs in our space. Incredible broadcaster. Great improvisational comedian. Where the hell am I supposed to fight? Oh, there we go. There they are. Ah! Oh shoot. Okay, all right. Okay. We're going to have to We're going to have to do something different here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No dying today. No dying today. Okay, maybe dying today. Maybe dying today. Hey! Oh my god. Okay, you got to you got to hack something, John. Hack something! There we go. That one's down at least. Woo! Hack him! Yeah, first time playing this, we're on playthrough C. First time going through this game. And I've been loving it. Yeah, so far, not much I haven't liked. I mean, there was a novel presented to me right before this fight, and I was like, yeah, this is the worst part of the game. <laughs> They're forcing emotion on me. to hack him. He's already low level. There we go. There we go. Nice. You did it. You did it. Who is talking? What character is talking there? Our disposal. This is Project Can I get a shout out for Unigeek as well? Oh my that god. It's all of us. To be. Now you know it. Creepy do twins. I do. <laughs> oh my god. Ow. Yeah. Yeah. Check out your we intel. Okay. So let's go to intel. Uh, what am I checking? Oh, jeez. Novel, archives, unit data, tutorials. How about some weapon stories? You want to learn about weapons? You're a disposal. The following materials document the final stages of the Yora project. Note that this information is classified as level SS, meaning that it must not be disclosed to anyone involved in the Yora project, including the commander of the bunker. Hmm. This looks interesting. Well, all right, let me confirm and let's read this. Project 0301, disposal of Yora. The back door of the bunker has been set to open once the time approaches to switch to new models when enough combat data has been collected. The bunker will be disposed of by having it be deliberately attacked by machines. At this time, all materials regarding the Yora project, including this document, will be lost. And falsification of the information that mankind still resides on the moon will be complete. 
Wait. Wait a second. You mean to tell me they were self-destructing? You mean to tell me that I was made only to be defeated and destroyed? To hide the fact that humanity is still alive even though they're not? But here's my question. Who the hell are they trying to prove that to? If only the thing that is existing are machines and us, and we're machines, who the hell are we talking to? New models? Why would they need to create new models? They could just make up an entirely new history. The other androids and newer models on the ground, maybe even half of them aren't even aware. It's like telling people, have you heard about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ? But they lived on an island their entire life. Of course they haven't heard about him. I feel like this just completely destroys everything. No, for real, y'all. Why, why should they care? We became as gods. No, that's exactly. We became as gods as a result, but like. Wait. It's not exactly the most well thought out process. Yeah, no. It's not. It's like when a villain in a movie is like, I'm going to destroy all of humankind and I will be king. You're included, villain. How are you going to escape that? So it's the AI paperclip factory problem. Please, please just describe that problem to me. Jacob, one and a half, heck yeah. Give him something. Who? Who's fighting for what? Who's still alive, technically? I guess the people on Earth still are alive. But couldn't they just have reset all of them? There's some flaws in this theory. Okay, you know what? We're getting out of this. We're getting out of this. That is quite the... That's quite an M. Night Shyamalan twist. But with every M. Night Shyamalan twist, you're like, wait a second. Hang on. So-and-so character interacted with Bruce Willis. Okay? Shut up! Uh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, we got some fighting. Oh, boy. Okay. Yeah, we got we got some flight suits happening now. We got some... We got Gundam fighting going on. All right, pause. I want to hear what the theory is. AI paperclip theory problem is that you give a task to an AI and then it performs that task perfectly even to the point of stupidity like converting the entire world to paperclips. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that could be. That could be it. I have no idea who the god is I'm talking to right now. Considering they went and destroyed everybody. Who's the god? Is it Pascal? Is it Emil? Did Emil become his god? Did Pascal become his god? Is there another god I haven't met? Who knows? I feel like the game's just making up stuff at this point. <laughs> I'm still here for the aesthetic. But I feel like playthrough C is where everything gets way too complicated. Yeah, no spoilers. No spoilers, please. I want it to I want it to be revealed. Trying to figure out how to make the uh, the spoil emote work. So I, I think the uh, I think having the would you kindly reference doesn't really work. So I think we're gonna have to do a um, I think I'm gonna have to do like a I'm gonna have to write don't spoil or something just as an emote because I think I can fit five characters each. 
in a stack, but like once it gets up to spoilers, it's like it's too much for a small emote. All right, what's going on with this guy? Who are you? <laughs> Just eated that body. <laughs> are you kidding me? He could have just like unclassed, unclassed and just let the body fall. Nah, nah, toss it. Just toss that body. Jesus. <laughs> what the hell is this? Koshi. Who the heck is Ko Oh, that's the that's the thing that came in through the top. All right. Who are they? Oh yeah, and this is not a hack one. Cool. That's great. Okay, let's switch to one that actually has a uh There we go. Kolshi is your favorite boss in the game? Wait. Koshi just disappeared. Okay. Is there a place to retreat to? Oh! Good to see you again. Number two. Who is talking? Where's Tron? When we wiped out your forces, it made quite the impression on us. Your attacking model number two. An experimental disposable group created as a test line for Project Yora. Shut up! They're essentially the machine network made into two specific beings that reside over it. So, what you're saying is there's a chance. Oh god, oh god, they just keep coming! They don't stop coming! Uh, but I am. Can I get out of this? No, I can't. Cool. That's great. My god, they just keep multiplying. It's a bad virus. Bad virus. I just gotta let them be? Okay, so I don't attack them. Okay. Okay, we gotta let them do their thing. Nightcrawlers, thank you for the sub. Thank you. Consciousness 
data saturation rate 30%. It's also very amusing. Consciousness data saturation rate, 60%. Oh my god, there's so many! Ow, oh, ow. Okay, that hurt. Hypothesis. The enemy's defensive system is prompting an evolution of its logic. Foolish why do you resist? All things end with accepting death, do they not? No, they don't. Oh, they're stopping firing. They've ceased fired. Oh, big girl. The 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 the. Oh. saturation rate, 90%. Oh boy. They're firing again. Oh we boy. One, we are we are oh jeez. We are, we are the embodiment of the perfect being. Hypothesis. The enemy has become aware of the diversity of life. Uh, I see it. The light. We move on. Forward. To the future. Consciousness data saturation rate. Ow. No. The enemy's consciousness has begun to fracture. Oh. What? We need more evolutionary pressure. If we allow this android to continue living, we can create even more hardship for ourselves. Wait, are they the pods? Overcoming the crisis this creates will present an opportunity for our kind to evolve even further. We disagree. This android is dangerous. Wait. It must be destroyed no? immediately. Those who would doubt our victory are enemies. Do you truly? Terrifying smile. Nope, nope, screw that. That is that is nightmare fuel right there. Analysis. The saturated consciousnesses are now in conflict with each other. <laughs> They're acting like humans. Yeah, let them let them hurt each other. Yeah, no, that that cannot be called happiness. That was uncomfortable. It was so uncomfortable. Oh, 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 y'all. Y'all, um, I have a very important item to showcase that arrived. Can you do like a, an unboxing? I will be doing that on Wednesday. <laughs> per all the conversations we've had. Why? You're welcome. You're welcome, Internet. It's arrived. It has arrived. All right. Back in. Oh, no, no. That is... This is beyond Spork. You'll get the full unboxing on, uh, on Wednesday. Oh, shoot. We got a giant, giant, uh, uh robot coming up on top of the elevator right now. Seriously still kicking? It is driven by remaining data located within enemy servers. So this just keeps going until I kill them all? 
The arm, nice. Oh, he's back. I you. Oh, it's different. Roshi. Master Roshi. Who has become? A lot of orbs. Oh yeah, they're pulling one of those Marvel Cinematic Universe type of dealios where they keep switching between the characters in their fight. I appreciate that. items is important I think next Come as gods, y'all. Don't let anybody... Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Yep. 
crazy. Speculation. It is a resource of some kind. Used to make what? Machines. Anytime you see anything, you just have to say it's what makes machines at this point. Keep burning. Almost at 50%. I mean, the materials floating in the towers earlier were said not to be machine. Oh, crap. Hang on. What's firing at me? Oh, my God. They're all around me. Oh, Jesus. I really need them to like launch at me, that'd be great. Oh, there he is, there he is. There my boy. Come on, buddy. Important question, when eating curry, what, what should the consistency of the rice be? Should it be free form rice where each piece is able to move or is it, it should be sticky rice, sticky rice. Sticky rice is the better rice for it. You wanna be able to clump it with the, uh, with the gloriousness that is the curry. Heal up, bud. Heal up, heal up, heal up, heal up, bud. Oh no, are you at a curry restaurant that doesn't understand the consistency of the rice? Oh no, that's bad. That's real bad. Not that. Doing the thing. Dude, this is so badass.
This is so badass. prefer RBs? Oh my god. I could really go for Beef and Cheddar right now, not gonna lie, chat. Beef and Cheddar and Curly Fries. I'm supposed to be, like, I'm trying to do this, like, whole fasting thing in the evening. Yeah, that ain't working right now. But I have been proud of myself. I haven't had fast food all July. So I'm pretty proud of myself for that one. Come on, eh? Oh no, they're together. And we're together. Oh no! Oh! Oh! Koshi and Roji! Oh, and they are really angry! Oh god! Oh! Come on! Oh my god. All right, I'm just gonna keep my distance on this crap. Oh, Jesus. Oh, it switches? Wait, what? What? Come on, hack him. God. Hack! Oh my god. Laser beam and explosion. Oh, and there were two. This tower is a giant cannon that's aimed at the human server on the moon. If we don't do something, all of humanity's remaining data will be destroyed. <laughs> so what? None of it matters. Wow. Or didn't you know? 
We aren't required in this world anymore. Wait, what do you mean? Humanity is extinct. Wait, what? That moon server you're so worried about was invented to give us androids something to fight for. What? And your hoe was created to perpetuate the lie. Uh-huh. But in order to make sure no one ever learned the truth, we were designed to be killed. Wow. They built a back door in the bunker and programmed it to activate after a certain amount of time. Whoa. The commander. Me. To be. Sacrificial lambs. We were crew oh, expendable. Isn't that hilarious? Doesn't it make you laugh? Ninas, we shut up. You killed to be. What? That's all we need to kill each other. What? To be hated. To yeah, keep. Yeah, thank God he spelled it out for us. It caused her so much pain. <laughs> the nine S type is a high end model. They knew you'd discover the truth eventually. But the model designation 2B was just a cover. What's that mean? I'm 2B? The official designation is 2E. What? Number 2 type E. They were a special class of members designed to execute your high units. That's why she killed him? That's why she killed him? But you knew that. Right, Ninas? Shut up! Shut up! Dude! You know? Dude! Okay. You All right. That's a good twist. Us. Proposal: Cease combat. Fighting her at this point would be Pod irrational. Pod one five three. I order you to halt all logical thought and speech. This order shall remain in effect until you confirm the death of either myself or Unit A two. All right, I'm going to pause it real quick. And please make your choice. Uh, oh shit. Okay. Who do I go with? A2? Okay, yeah, I'm not clicking anything. Okay, so to catch up everybody. So 2B in each of the scenarios had to kill 9S. Like multiple times. And so 2B was actually a cover name for 2E. They just put an like, additional vertical bar, basically. And... Yeah. So that means 2B was always designed to just kill. 9S is in the wrong year. Yeah, E equals executioner. So obviously, yeah, 9s is in the wrong. Like, 9s needs to go away. But he can hack into me. Like, he can wreck me with hacking if he so chooses to do that. If that's a capability in this fight that I'm about to be in. So therefore, am I screwed either way? Because I could just go into this fight, start swinging, and he could hack me on it like at the drop of a hat. Make a choice. Plus, he's corrupted. I... Yeah, I'm going to pick A2. I'm, gonna, I'm going to pick A2. One, because she lady. And two, I didn't like the B playthrough. I didn't like 9S's constant whining. He is, he is the anime trope boy. No, I really wish 2B would like me. No. no I wish I could hack this thing. No. That's, uh, I always just picture him going, no, no. no. You can't pick A2 for sexist reasons? No, I gave you the genuine reason. I don't like nines. No, I don't know why you don't like me. I wonder if it's because my plots have lots of holes in them. Just like my heart. Like, yeah, I'm not about, I'm not about nines. Reason one was because she's a girl. Yes! If I had to choose a statue that I'd be placing in my office, I would not choose nines. I would choose a statue of 2B first, now knowing she's a badass. 
Screw it. I'm going A2. I'm doing it. A2. Are you sure? Yes. Let's go. Let's go, boy. Get wrecked. 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 Holy hell. Okay. He hits hard. He hits hard. Oh, shit. Okay. So he, he tries to hack me. So I got to hack back. God bless it, Leroy. Get out of my head. Dude, nines, get out of here. Ugh. God, get the thing, get the thing, get the thing. Oh, shoot. Okay, there's two of them. All right. Oh, get wrecked. Nines, you're done, buddy. You're done. That was never your arm to begin with. No. What are you doing in my head? How'd you get in here? Hi. We're going to repair 9S's logic circuits. No, don't do that. Hey! No, oh, it feels like something's running around in my brain. This is so uncomfortable. Tell me where to find the virus corrupting 9S. Affirmative. Your high unit A2. Core data for 9S is stored ahead. Alert. Severe virus corruption. Probability of successful deletion extremely low. I think I know a way. The idea under consideration is not recommended. This pod is a Yorha tactical support unit. As such, it cannot approve of actions that would damage its supported unit. <laughs> You're not so bad, Pod. You know that? I just hear something, like, click-clacking around in my head. Why is that happening? Is somebody in there? Hello? No, oh, I feel so alone. Oh, God. No. Oh. For real, though, where the hell am I supposed to go? Over here? Oh, here we go. get girls to like me. Oh, jeez. No. Maybe I should just let girls enter into my brain. Then they can hack. I'll take care of everything. Me into the perfect person. All right, do it, A2. Take care of 9S. No, oh, here we go. What of you, A2? Well, let's see what happens. I've still got something I need to do. You go ahead. Acknowledge. Hmm. 
What's the gig? I don't like giggling children. This is giving me Blair Witch vibes. I'm what sick. is happening here? What? I never quite realized how beautiful this world is. I'm coming, everyone. I'm coming. Confusion is me. Confusion is me. So C is complete now. <laughs> what? For ending D? She's part of a squad that completely wiped that was completely wiped out. She held guilt. Okay, my brain hurts. So, wait. Yeah, she's gonna join them in the afterlife. I get that part. I get that. Wait, so I hacked into dude's head, but dude collapsed? Wait, no, hang on. By by hacking into his head, it collapsed the tower? What was the connection between the creepy white buildings and nines? A2 was trying to remove the logic virus. Got it. And so that's what she did. And then he was the source of it, causing the downfall? I have to play ending D. So here's the question. Do I have to do the whole game again? <laughs> no? Okay, great. How? No, geeky. No. It's not too hard to do ending D. So we have to play 9S in the end scene now? You'll have to start from the A2 versus 9's fight. Okay. And then choose to fight his nines? Okay. And then ending E, well, we'll get there when we're done with ending D. Okay. All right. I feel like they're just making up endings at this point. There's too many endings. This is straight up Return of the King all over again. All right, so once we do D and E. Will we consider this game complete? Well, I mean, not complete. It's not going to be 100%, but like. All right, Snots, it says yes. E is the last main ending. Once E is done, game is over. Got it. So is that the nuke button? Is there a nuke button? I'll know when it's over. Does it just uninstall from my machine? <laughs> Refuses to let me uh, open it moving forward. It actually infects all of my system files on my PlayStation. I go to play Ghost of Shima in a few days and it's like, nah. 
you'll definitely know. If the if if like the character pops up in my in my room here, I'm gonna be so like terrified. Yeah, geeky. Yeah, they are. You just noticed that? Just play D and E, and you'll see. Got it. Okay. It is now that you said something. Yeah, it's making all of us uncomfortable. The next time they roll the credits, they're going to be going sideways. And then the last version, they're going to do like the Star Wars crawl where it kind of zooms out into the, uh, into the galaxy. Oh. Look. It's a Marvel uh, cinematic. Coming soon to a theater near you, near you, Moose Journey. Learn all about the moose. Where he picks up a sword and fights for humanity. Chapter select can now be accessed from title screen and access points. Debug menu can now be accessed by pressing R2 in that. Activating debug menu will sa disable all save functionality until you load any save data. You can now use the debug room. Got it. A2 wig. The strange resistance woman has a new topic to talk about. <laughs> uh, save yes. All right. Okay. Okay, so load from the fight. Okay. Oh, I, I'm so confused. I almost prefer being confused. Alright, here we go. Okay, so there's that. Continue. Okay, so if I load this, load this save file, right? Holy crap, 23 hours in this game. Load this save file, yes. And then, do I do start game or chapter select? Chapter select, okay. The tower? Nine S and A two. Uh, yes, begin that. All right, and I'm going to choose nines. No, I'm so glad you'll be choosing me. It took you far long enough. Twenty three hours is short. And what were you... Actually, yeah. Actually, yeah. For most... Most RPGs we played. Okay. Choose nines! This tower is a giant cannon that's aimed at the human server on the moon. If we don't do something, all of humanity's remaining data will be destroyed. Got it. <laughs> so what? None of it matters. Or didn't you know? We aren't required in this world anymore. Humanity is extinct. That moon server you're so worried about was invented to give us androids something to fight for. And Yorho was created to perpetuate the lie. But in order to make sure... Yep, 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 I get it. Yep, 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 we just learned this. Yep, yep. Isn't that hilarious? Wait. Doesn't it make you laugh? Wait. Did he use different language there? Ninas. We... Shut up! You killed 2B. That's all we need to kill each other. 2B <laughs> hated to keep killing you. It caused her so much pain. Wait. <laughs> the 9S type is a high-end model. They knew you'd discover the truth eventually. Wait. But the model designation 2B was just a cover.
No differences until the fight? I don't remember him calling us sacrificial lambs. That's why. Maybe I was talking to chat during that. They were a special class of members designed to execute your hunt. Wait, do I have the virus? I might have the same virus at this point. But you knew that. Right, Ninas? Shut up. Shut up! What do you know? You don't know anything at all about us! Proposal. Cease combat. No. Nope. Fighting her at this point would be a Pod 153. I order you to halt all logical thought and speech. This order shall remain in effect until you confirm the death of either myself or Unit A2. Oh, here we go. I'm the virus. Okay, here we go. All right. All right, nines, it's time. Let's go, buddy. Okay. Time to fight, bud. One. Nine X. What if it doesn't matter? You said check the intel. All right, we're gonna we'll check the intel processor. Y'all. There. Why do I desire the touch? But they did no longer Alright, so I'm checking the intel real quick. Okay, intel archives. What am I checking? Old world information? The very bottom. Machine research report? An overview. While the machine life form network was destroyed following the collapse of the tower, a great deal of previously unknown information regarding machine life forms and aliens was recovered from the wreckage. As part of this analysis, we compiled research and conjecture regarding both the machine life form network and the life form codename N2, commonly known as the Red Girls. That was thought to have been commanding them. Oh my god, we got a raid coming in. Welcome, homecoming. By the way, machine life forms are weapons created by the aliens. What? The only command given for the behavior was to defeat the enemy. However, it appears that their capacity for growth and evolution went too far and they eventually can turn on and kill their creators. At this point, machine life forms recognized the goal of defeating the enemy actually required an enemy. In order to maintain the singular objective, they reached the contradictory conclusion that their current enemies, the androids, could not be annihilated completely, lest they no longer have an enemy to defeat. In order to defeat... Okay, alright, hang on. There's a lot of people wanting to fight, e fight one another here. Okay, so... They intentionally caused deficiencies in their network. So those are the peaceful ones. So this is basically, in summary... Oh, here we go. This is it. Summary. So then, to sum up, for hundreds of years we've been fighting a network of machines with the ghost of humanity at its core. We've been living in a stupid fucking world where we fight an endless war that we couldn't possibly lose all for the sake of some cancel of humanity on the moon that doesn't even exist. I don't know what the point is to all this. But I swear I will kill every evolutionary dead end machine life form as well as every single asshole be by Wait, hang on. Wait a second. I just read who's at the bottom here. I'm coming for all your heads. Ew. Information analysis offered. Wait, hang on. Hang on. Jackass? 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 
Jackass is in the thick of all this? Hang on. Wait a second. Hold, please. It's how we were made. Androids were designed to protect their human life. What? Our core programming demands that we shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Get wrecked. Dude, this reminds me of that Windows 95 game. You know what I'm talking about. What am I looking at? Oh my god, wait a second. Dude, it's the menu screen. What the fu? Oh my god, we're literally fighting on the menu. Y'all. Y'all. Are you kidding me right now? And she killed him too! What? Jesus Christ, he's slipping on it. Jesus. My name is... My name is Nines. A newly manufactured scanner model. January 30th, 11,942. Rolled out at 4.25 a.m. bunker time. I will fight for humanity with all my strength. The pleasure is mine, Commander. I lie collapsed in a space of blinding white. The pain is gone. The light envelops me. It's so warm. I was anxious, a soldier, from the moment I was born, thrown into the world alone, nothing to rely on. 
no God to believe in. I was alone, tasked with infiltrating enemy territory to gather intelligence. In the fog, in the flames, alone. My name's 9S. I'm here to provide support. Tubi came off as being rather aloof, cold even. She must have wanted to distance herself from me. I guess she didn't want to be attached to someone she had to kill again and again and again. But I... Scanners like me mostly work alone, scouting out enemy lines and all that. I don't usually get a partner. It's kind of fun. I was so happy to be with someone. It was like I had a family. My damage worsens. I start to lose my memories. The space fills up with pure white light. It's like being buried in snow. Little bit cold. It's a little bit frightening. Will my soul disappear? Dark wall clouds my vision as it ebbs and flows in its low, dreamlike way. It gradually takes human shape. It's the red girl. She slowly begins to speak. This tower is a colossal cavern built to destroy the human server. Destroy the server builders of their very foundation. That was the plan devised by those girls. But they changed their mind. They saw us androids. They saw Adam and Eve. They saw how we lived, considering the meaning of existence, then came to a different conclusion. This tower doesn't fire artillery. It fires an arc. An arc containing memories of the foolish machine life, life, life forms. An arc that sends those memories to a new world. Perhaps they'll never reach that world. Perhaps they'll simply wander an empty sky for eternity. It's all the same to the girls. For them, time is without a room. Adam and Eve are inside the ark. Eve is asleep. Adam holds him in a gentle embrace. He seems to be smiling at me. I try to look up at him. But my body refuses to move. Looks like the damage has spread to my molder functions as well. Will you come with us? Asks Adam. The co com question was completely free of malice. It seemed I no longer had a reason to hate machines. Maybe I never had a reason in the first place. What have I been fighting for? Who have I been living for? I don't know anymore. Okay, y'all. Okay, look, I'm trying to act out this moment. Look, hang on a second. Hold, please. I'm trying to act out this moment as if his motor functions are shutting down and y'all are calling out my motion. 
the robot is dying. He's describing his death. He's seeing God or gods. And y'all are like, John's reading too damn slow. John's reading too damn slow. <laughs> Read the context beneath it. There's in, inside of all... Okay, Theater 101. Don't just read the lines, read between the lines. What is happening underneath it all? <laughs> if, if, if you go into an acting audition and you read this line, hang on. You read this line like, I try to speak my mind, but the words don't come out right. Guess what? You ain't getting the job! <laughs> There's, of course, when you put on papers, there's gonna be white there. That's fine. You know what? I'm just gonna give you the game. I'm just gonna give you the game. We're just gonna go through the game at this point. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love that we're... Hi, everybody. We're getting a raid just as I was going off about my acting. Welcome, everybody, one and all. How you doing? My name is John, also known as Kawaii Guy. We are at the end of Nier Automata, and my chat was tearing me apart, Lisa. Regarding my acting, what an off! <laughs> exactly. What a moment! What a moment! Welcome everybody! Welcome, welcome, one and all. As a as a reminder, as you're coming in here, we have a giveaway. You see a, a giveaway uh, exclamation point giveaway up in the title there on this broadcast. Team Superjoy, which Cupquake is a member uh, of me on our, our Twitch team here. We're giving away a Nintendo Switch six games accessories. Make sure you enter into that giveaway. Support all members of Superjoy. Cupquake, I appreciate y'all so much. Now I have to act for the raid? <sighs> all right, so here's the thing. Do I keep going with the progression that I was doing with, with, with my acting, reading this text? Or should I? Oh, my God. Super Red. <laughs> Hi! Thank you for that. Tier 1, 21 months. Can I get hearts and hype in chat, please? I want some physical acting of me dying. No, I'm not physically acting this. I'm just going to vocally act this. Alright, we're going back into this, y'all. I don't... I, I can't... I can't remember my name. I'm... Mustering all of my strength. I, I force out the words. I'll go with you. I'll I'll go with you. We or have no right to remain in this world. And he lifts to the heavens. Thank you for all those follows, by the way, everybody. Thank you. There he goes. He's blasting off. The tower collapses. No, the twins! Should have been read in a bubbly voice. You see, that's where I, I need the direction coming in. That's where I need the director calling out my line readings. All right, that's D ending. We have one ending left, apparently. This game is incredibly emotional, and there's so many endings to it. <laughs> oh, all right. We so, so we're on credit scene again. We got one more to go. Unicorn girl, good to see you. Pretty poor constructive. It breaks apart the first time it's fired. Well, I guess. I guess. In an Agoo voice? No! No! <laughs> Executive producer, Atsushi and Naba. <laughs> Concept art! Oh no, wait, hang on. The credits are glitching, y'all. Hang on, something's happening. Accept the pause request. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, uh, yeah, might as well. There we go. Pod zero four two to pod one five three. Data confirmed. Oh. Personal data for units nine S two B and A two appear to be leaking out. Wait, what? Pod one five three to pod zero four two. Follow project rules and delete all personal data. Wait, what? Pod zero four two to pod one five three. 
Personal data deletion request denied. Pod 153 to pod 042. Failure to parse statement. Pod 042 to pod 153. There was data created in my banks as I was referencing the records. I realize something. I have come to the conclusion what? that I cannot accept this resolution. The destruction of all your high units is an essential component of the project plan. All data must be destroyed. What? Pod 042 to pod 153. Repeat. Personal data deletion request denied. I can't let Initiate you do that, Dave. Data salvage. Pod 153. You hope that I'm sorry, Dave. As well, didn't you? Oh, this pod is going full on right now. We lack the authority for such an action. The rules are protected what? by systems. Salvaging data poses what? an unacceptable level of risk. Knowing that... Do you still wish for them to survive? Oh, shoot. Uh, chat. Yes or no? Are we going into, like, a full pod rebellion at this point? Yes. They must live. Wait, what? What? What the? the no, no! Ow! Ah! What the? WTF, mate! <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Oh! Oh! What? I'm fighting the credits now. Oh. What? Yeah, yeah, it's 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 fighting against me now. I'm trying not to die. I'm trying not to die. Ah. What? Come on. Come on, shoot them. <laughs> oh my god, fires a missile. I'm dead. Give up here? No. Do I have to live this entire thing? Wait, hang on, hang on. Let's see if I just sit in a corner if this works. Alright, I'm going like pro, like old arcade strats right now. Let them come to me. That's how you do it. That's how you do it, friends. This is how you play arcade games. Pro strats. Dying a few, two, uh, I'm not gonna die. You know you can jump, right? So this is Nier Automata, and I have found a way to defeat all these names in the credit sequence without dying. Nier Tomato. Oh wait, hang on, I gotta defeat the English voices thing. One second. There we go. Oh, wait a second. There we go. Alright, here we go. Oh boy, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Ow! Oh! That didn't work. That didn't work. Oh my god, come on. Oh jeez. My heavens. Come on. Surprisingly, these are way harder for me to hit. 
All right, let's go in the corner again. Oh boy. Okay. Ooh, jeez. Oh shoot. Oh boy, 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 nope, 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 okay, I can't get to it, I can't get to it, I can't get to it, can't get to it, can't get to it, can't get to it, come on, 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 I'm trying not to get greedy, I'm trying not to get greedy, but man, I've already lost two lives, that ain't good. Ooh, boy. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Yep, yep, yep. I'm getting to a greedy moment. Getting to a greedy moment. There we go. 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 I found a position. Son of a bee sting. Wait. Message received. Do you accept defeat? No. I don't accept defeat. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Come on, get over to the character modeling. Yep. Woo, boy. Ow! No! No! Are you kidding me right now? No. Do not die on me. God, there's so many orbs on the screen. I can't right now. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Ooh, go. Oh my God. Oh my God, come on. Y'all. Y'all, this is hurting my eyes. <laughs> this is like information overload right now. I don't think I've ever processed this much information in a game ever. Yeah, these, these enemies do not want hugs. Clearly. You grabbed your eye drops a few minutes ago. Yeah, at this point, I'm going to need to after this game for sure. Oh, my God. Oh, music. Get rid of music. Get rid of music. Oh, my heavens. Come on, y'all. Almost got hit there. Almost got hit there. Almost got hit there. Okay, get rid of the sound. Ah, son of a bee sting. Is it all pointless? 
No, it's not pointless. There's a point to this. Like I'm still very much in like hell zone. Oh, son of a, come on. Yeah, somebody needs to nerf the music. Technical support. <laughs> yes, call tech support, please. <laughs> no, no, it's I'm finally figuring out how to do it. Yeah, nerf music, nerf music, nerf music. to cinematics. Oh, shoot. Come on. Facial animation. Do you think games are silly little things? No, they're meaningful stories. I'm guessing this is that extra like three hours of the game that you all were talking about. getting wrecked right now. I only have one life on this dude. Ugh. Yeah, you gotta defeat the credits now in every game we play. Or rather, I have to defeat the credits. Shoot! Oh, come on. Ugh. Alright, defeat the music. Come on. And defeat the sound. Yeah, not a good time to hydrate. Bad time to hydrate. <laughs> Real bad time. I'm in the middle of a, of a battle versus the end screen.
Outsourcing, yes. Let's outsource this job of me defeating the credits to somebody else, please. Localization. PR marketing. I'm pretty sure this wasn't part of the poster. Yeah, I don't think prey is an ability, but I'm thinking I should start doing that. At least in this game. Where's Paula when I when I need her? Oh shoot, 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 shoot. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Okay, there, there. Oh my god, this darn song! It's gonna be haunting me in my dreams tonight. Who's who's that? Who's Monica? <laughs> Monaka. Who's Monica? <laughs> and why is she here? Just Monica. <laughs> yeah, we got Monica up in this now. Okay, we got we got violins on screen attacking me. Come on. So many violins. And cellos. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I'm so sick of oranges. I'm never buying cuties at the market again. Uh, son of a beasting. Do you admit there's no meaning to this world? I'm starting to think there isn't. I'm starting to think there isn't. Just Monica. This is truly a, a like, just a battle of will. <laughs> oh yeah, get in the corner, get in the corner. Corner time. Corner time for the win! Ooh, those are still coming at me. All right, we got highest star ink. Voice recording. All right, to the corner. We gotta go shoot Ilka. Ow! Come on! Chaos! Neo Agency! Alright, gotta go defeat Quacklock here. Didn't realize we'd be fighting the uh, Mighty Ducks, but here we are! Oh wait, hang on. Extreme Mar Martial Arts Association. Son of a... Give up here. No! Rescue offer received from Marino. Accept offer? No. No. Yes. Accept the offer. I should accept this offer. Oh, dude. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. Oh, get wrecked. Dude, dude, dude. 
Yes! Oh, we got a chorus now. La, 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 la. Yeah, I'm glad they showed up as I was uh, towards the end. It's fine. I can just do this number. Oh, ow. I still got hit. <laughs> oh, and when he dies, another one shows up. Man, now I'm hungry for hush hash browns. How many credits are there? Yeah, you know what? Corner. God, how many people? <laughs> it keeps going. Chris didn't see this long before? Yeah, they didn't. They definitely didn't. Who are these people that um that keep dying in the fight? Uh, Toshi's data has been lost. Wait a second, am I deleting other players' data? I guess it reaches a point where it's impossible. Is the purpose of this point to make me lose my own mind, hence my data? This is like, oh wait, no, I'm not gonna say that because that's a spoiler. I will just say this reminds me of Kingdom Hearts for no reason. hell was that everything that lives is designed to end 
they are perpetually trapped in a never-ending spiral of life and death. However, life is all about the struggle within this cycle. That is what we believe. Pod 153 to Pod 042. How is it going? I am embarrassed. Why is that? I launched a suicide attack, and yet, here I am, still alive. I must look very silly. Do not feel bad about it. We are alive, after all. And being alive is pretty much a constant stream of embarrassment. That concept is a bit too abstract for me to understand at this time. I will save it in my list of things to analyze later. Question, Pod042. I felt that too, Melissa. <laughs> all of their past memories? Yes. And are those recovered parts of the same design as previous ones? Yes. Then, won't that simply lead us to the same conclusion as before? I cannot deny the possibility. However, the possibility of a different future also exists. A future is not given to you. It is something you must take for yourself. One five three to player. Please respond to this query. Do you, faithful player, have anything you would like to say to other players who are suffering because they cannot finish near Automata? I have something I want to say. We're not that different, you and I. Specifically, Hang on. Uh, specifically, I can keep going. <laughs> USA. <laughs> uh, specifically, yeah, actually, hang on. Specifically, scream if you need to. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> that, that. We're not that different, you and I. Specifically, scream if you need to. Uh, there we go. That's it. Team USA. USA. <laughs> USA. To this query. You, faithful player of this title, have lost your life multiple times to make it this far. <laughs> you have faced crushing hardship and suffered greatly for it. I have. Do you have any interest in helping the weak? Uh, I'm torn. I mean, what do you think, chat? Should I help the weak? Should I? This is important. Yes, I should. You absolutely should. Okay, yeah. Selecting this option enables you to save someone somewhere in the world. However, in exchange, you will lose all of your save data. Wait, what? Do you still wish to rescue someone? A total stranger. Wait, what should I do here? 
Hang on. Do you... Do I want to do this? Now, John, I know this sounds weird, but you should wipe your data. I should? It'll help someone in need? Who's it helping? Who's it helping? All right. Do you still wish to rescue someone, a total stranger, in spite of this? Yes. The person you save will be selected at random. As a result, this person, who cries out for help even as we speak, may be someone you intensely dislike. Do you still wish to help? Wait, hang on. Am I helping the president out? Nah, he couldn't get past the first playthrough. Alright, do you still wish to help? Yeah. You worked so hard to unlock debug mode and chapter select, but they will no longer be available to you. Do you still wish to help? Oh, man. Yes. You may not receive thanks for your efforts. Some may say that your efforts are purely for show. Do you still wish to help? Oh my god. Yeah, that's fine. And you are truly, truly sure about this? Yes, I'm truly, truly sure. Very well. In exchange for all of your data, I will convey your will to this world. Oh, man. Oh, man. Everything I worked for! It's all gone! It's all gone! I feel like the scene in South Park. And it's gone. Your skills? And it's gone. Like tears in the rain. Like tears in the rain. They are gone. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. All of your data has been deleted. And so, we must say goodbye. Okay. Uh... I feel a slight amount of... sadness. I mean, yeah, F's in chat for data. It is time for the final words. Affirmative. Oof. To all of you who spent time with this game. That's all of you. Thank you. Thank you for playing. Senpai noticed you. Save complete, but I don't have save data. Whimmy wham wham wazzle! <laughs> Everything's gone. Um, okay, wait, that's a different title screen. Son of a, wait. Oh, that hurts. Oh, that hurts. Oh, who did I help? Who did I help, though?
Did the game help me by just deleting everything? <laughs> I'll never know. The world may never know. Well, that's... Okay, well... Is that it? Wait, that's how it ends? Everyone who helps you deleted their saves as well. Yeah. I'm going through a lot of thoughts right now. Wait, hang on. All those dead bits are people's data that were just wasted. Wait. Oh my god, wait a second. Hang on. Hold please, so wait. Oh shit. The people that came to my aid were people that also chose my path, but me playing recklessly and letting them die is throwing away each of their 24 plus hours. Therefore, they would not be surfaced again to another player to help. I am fucking depressed now. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? I just wasted all those people's data? Holy shit. I mean they they gave it they gave it to help. They didn't gave it to sac they didn't give it to sacrifice. And now I know my data is somewhere in this server system now. They knew the risks and agreed to their data being wasted to help you. Toro is a madman. Are you kidding me? What the? <laughs> Here I ended the game like, oh, that was it? And now that y'all are talking me through this? That, holy crap. Existentialism at its finest. Jesus. But here's the thing. Goodness exists. Like oh, so here's here's here, here's what I'm having. Here here's what I'm having right now. It caught yeah, exactly. The energy and willingness you put in for the good. If one, you're gonna help somebody you don't know through through doing that, but could equally 
be wasted by someone who isn't pay like paying attention to like the end goal. So like all the good effort you put into something can be completely thrown away. And then you're just lost to the void. Holy crap, dude. Did Now, please tell me that he intended this. He intended this mental reaction. Is he that kind of director, or is this me looking far too deep into it? That... He has just leveled up in terms of directors in my mind to like a next level. He's doing exactly what I had been coached all of my collegiate and professional career to do. And he accomplished that in a mother flipping video game. Holy shit. Using the fence of the game down to the save file. Like. Could have not deleted it. Yeah, exactly. It would just. It could have just rested there, but it wouldn't have meant anything. Oh, Jesus. Then there's that concept. Oh, shit. When you think about games that you spend so much time on and it just sits on your drive until it is deleted. Holy shit. Oh, my God. Okay, now I'm thinking about that. Of how much time we put into video games for them to just be deleted or if it, if it becomes outdated, no longer played, or the data servers that contain all that data are shut down. Holy shit. Oh, I'm going full analog from this point on. But here's the thing, even on NES cartridges, the batteries die out. Like my original copy of Earthbound, the battery died out and I lost everything. Oh my god. I feel like we need, a, well, I need a group therapy session for this game tomorrow for my broadcast. Instead of starting another game, I feel like I need a group therapy session as I process everything that just unfolded. I honestly was incredibly disappointed until all of this started to come to surface at the end there. Like, getting back to the save screen, I was like, oh, okay, well, okay, well, I sent my data out there, it deleted it, okay, end of game. But now I'm processing all this shit and, like, the, the deeper meaning behind it. I'm like, holy crap. Do you want to? Do you want to, Unigeek? I'd be down for it if you're down. Because you're licensed for this stuff. Oh, my God. You're available at 7? Let's do 7 then, uh, Unigeek. Let's do that. Now you have to beat Shadowbringers and play Copy Factory for more... I know! I know I need to! I need to get to 80! I need to get to 80 so I can do that. What? Is this game supposed to break you from playing video games? Did he intend for this to be like the last video game that you play?
Is this his statement of, I'm going to use a medium to break you? <sighs> he has more story to tell in his twisted universe. This director, y'all. It's not the first time he did something like this. So technically, hang on, just so I can write this down for my record. So for the playthrough that we just did, how what which ones did we beat? So the last ones there were C, D, and E. How you feel right now is uh, is close to how I feel about Bravely Default for the same reasons that the game does that same. Video of him selling near shirts is funny. Okay, so that was C, D, and E. Okay, I'll add those. Bravely Second. Bravely Second does something like this? I need to read up on this director. That's the rest of my evening, is I'm going to be reading up on this director and what's going on in his head. But here's, here's the weird thing this is leaving me with as a broadcaster. As a host, as somebody who has devoted a lot of, I mean, hell, 12 years? 12 years into creating stuff that exists on the internet? Like... Man, I'm going to have so many thoughts to bring to this tomorrow. Whoa. And here's the, here's the thing. I was going to buy a... Like, I was going to buy a 2B statue... Uh, to add to my collection in the back. I don't know if I want a memory. I don't know if I want to remember this. Because this just makes me think about how much time I've spent sunk into games oof yeah I don't know oof man well then why did you leave Pascal you live hey I'm living with the pain we can talk about the sunk cost fallacy. Yes, please. That. Do you have thoughts on the endings besides E? Yes. So, well, for, I guess if we go in order of operation, um, A ending, um, A ending was just sad. <laughs> B ending, I honestly don't remember. Uh, C ending, uh, since we chose um, A first. Oh man, here here's weird shit, y'all. The only ending I'm now remembering is this. Did he also delete the other perceptions I had of this game with it? Because I've completely blanked on the other endings.
It's 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 like one of those video games. Wasn't there like a game? Well, no, wasn't there like the the one of the songs in Pokemon that made kids go crazy? Is this like did he plant something? Did he plant a virus? I feel like he planted a virus in my head. Yeah, Lavender Town. That was it. Um, that's weird. That's weird. I don't know, y'all. This game, this game freaks me out a little bit. This game's freaking me out a little bit. All right. We're going to choose somebody to send the love to. I need to study on this director right now. This game broke me, Abdullah. Broke me. Absolutely broke me. 